What's up, everybody? Welcome, Spot Spot, and welcome to Slob Guns on Tour. We're at Shot Show uh, Day Two, and I'm here at the Odin Works booth. Odin Works, one of the leaders, I guess, for anything modern sporting rifle related. I guess that's the new politically correct term for yeah. ARs. Uh, and every year, it seems like you've been growing and growing your product offerings. Now, uh, in a separate video, we discussed your awesome suppressors, which I own a couple of. Uh, but let's take a look at your newer products for this year. Uh, for the modern sporting rifle platforms, and then I guess you have a couple of surprises as well. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> All right, so one thing that, uh, we, you know, we've been in existence for 10 years, and we didn't even have an FFL until like year seven, right? Maybe year six, but so we really built the brand on accessories and barrels and parts and pieces, and one of those things is this vice block. If you've seen our stuff, you've probably seen this vice block. This year, we actually modified it, so this is what you're used to getting. So now we have these inserts. We cut out the vice block a little bit more, and this is your upper receiver vice block. Now you just pin in this insert, and you can stick your lower on or your gun and work on your gun. So it's a modular vice block system. We have AR-15, AR-10, and also we're going to do a Glock AR-9 insert. So And you know, product idea, AICS compatible one. There you go. <laughs> Absolutely. See, there we go, collaborating already. So. Uh, the vice block is awesome. We sell a ton of them. It's not super sexy, but we all need it, right? Yeah, absolutely. We, we want to work on our guns and build our guns. Uh, the next thing would be, uh, this is another little accessory. So if you recognize this, this is an Arrow Lower EPC-9. And believe it or not, we get calls every day, hey, will you do an extended button? It comes with an extended button, but people want something from us. Absolutely. So here is you know, a little extended button for the Arrow EPC-9 Lower. It's going to be available in colors and black, which I think people really want the colors. So that's a little system there. Now, the, are the new vice blocks and uh, the extended mag release, are those already available right now? or in production right now, so I would anticipate them on the website in the next week or okay. two and then shipping a couple weeks after that. Awesome. All right, the next one is our big uh, hitter this year. So this is uh, obviously a bipod. So this is a full feature bipod. Um, it does everything forwards, backwards, it swivels, uh, comes with an ARCA clamp. We're going to have a Picatinny clamp available. Um, you can lock the system. Uh, you can adjust the tension here. Um, this is a locking button, so it just stays in one position. You, the legs are independent. You can go really wide or you can go tall or you can go, you know, something standard in the middle or you can figure, configure it any way you want to. Legs pull out, they self-retract, push a button, they come back in. It's going to use Atlas feet, so whatever feet you want to put on it, uh, that's going to be an option. So this right here is in the prototype stage. Um, we're going to hope to be shipping this uh, in the mid summer, end of summer. Uh, we got a lot of work left to do on it, but this is the this is the brainchild, the baby. We're looking really forward to have it on on the market. Yeah. And okay, when I first saw it, I'm like, wait, that's a weird new AccuTac. But then I look at the features and how it functions. Like, wait, that's a really weird looking SkyPod. And fortunately, said like I, I saw them. Like, wow, this is like a really, really, really cool bipod because I mean, it's built like an AccuTac. I mean, like it looks sure. very, very solid, but it has so many features and modularity that you find on that SkyPod. But I guess it's not going to be priced like. I like, <laughs> I like yeah, one of those. You know, like we said in other videos, something that we really believe in is affordable quality, and we really believe that we have it here. So, MSRP, we're not set in stone on it, but we're looking at 349. Yeah. So, originally we actually wanted to do 249, but uh, with all everything going on here and all the parts that we have to make, it's just not feasible. So, look in that 350 range and uh, should be a really amazing bipod for anything you want to do. Yeah, so I mean, and it's, hopefully it's going to be out for, you're still going to have plenty of matches that you can use it in, yep. um, especially the finales and all that. But I mean, it's just awesome bipod. It has every single feature I can possibly think of that you would need. And most of all, it's going to be attainable for 99% of gun owners out Absolutely. there. Absolutely. Obviously, we're going to do it in black. Something people really like from us is colors. So we actually might come up with a pretty slick color scheme on that. But no promises. Something we might do, though. Very, very cool. All right. And then, obviously, Odin Works over the past couple of years, you have also uh, gone into stop goods. So yep. you've done uh, suppressor covers. And then I saw this thing, which is like, I'm like, I did not know you make that. Yeah, so this is new <laughs> this year. So this is the same clamping system that's on the bipod. 
uh, you're going to be able to buy that separately, but we also have a plate. Um, this will go right onto your arc of rail, and the way we designed it, you can actually turn this plate 90 degrees so it can sit awesome. like this on the gun or like that on the gun. Um, this bag is, we make all of these bags and this design, so uh, with Velcro, you can actually open it and take fill out, put more fill in, change the fill. Um, this right here, MSRP on this is going to be 149 for everything you see here. So again, affordable, functional, looks good and uh, should work on anything with ARCA. And for those who already don't use a bag such as this or are not familiar with the ARCA uh, clamping system, how would a gun owner typically use this? And is it just for match people? Is it for hunters? Who is it for? You know, this is for any shooter that wants a stable platform. So if you put the Picatinny adapter on this or the ARCA adapter and you have that on a rifle, you stick that on your rifle and this soft bag will give you a stable platform for easier shooting, more uh, precise shooting. So it's not just for hunters, just not for competitors. It's really for anybody that wants to make shooting a little bit easier. And is the bag, is it going to come already with the fill inside? It will. Okay. Yep. yep. It's going to come uh, probably just like this, um, definitely with the fill, and then uh, you adjust it the way you want it. Okay. And what's the pricing? What's the availability? Availability. I'm sorry, we talked about the pricing. Yep. But <laughs> so availability, again, will be uh, probably in the next month or two. Awesome. We and have the plates ready to go. We just have to finish making more of these. Uh, bags are ready to go, so um, it's going to be short order. And if somebody wanted to switch it from one position to the other position, how would they do that? Uh, you just take, so the Velcro straps here, okay. just take the bag off, and there's a couple of screws on the bottom. Just loosen those, take them out, turn it 90 degrees, and put it back on. Okay. And I guess it's going to attach with a quick latch. Yep. So. yep, you got the quick throw lever. Uh, this you can set up to tighten. This is on the loose side right now, and then it's tightened like that. You can swap that if you want to. It's up to you. And I guess the, for those not familiar, so I mean, the advantage of going with the Arca rail is the fact that unlike with the Picatinny rail where it's going to be fixed on to that one position, with this, you can just loosen it. You can slide it forward, back, uh, whatever you want it to yep. do. Wherever you have that Arca rail on there, you can put this on there. And like I said, the beauty is we can have this on the front of the gun, then still leave enough room on the rail that they can mount it into right. a tripod. Uh, they can still have space for barricade stop, anything That's else right. they might use. And the wonderful thing about Arca is almost everyone that does Arca has a quick release lever. So you just pop that off and, you know, a second later it's off the gun if, you, you know, whatever you want to do. And I guess is, only, is that going to be the only color? Because I'm sure if you're going to make the other stuff in other colors. <laughs> uh, you know, that's a great question. You know, it kind of depends on demand. Yeah. Uh, right now, this is the only color. But if there are people that, you know, there's enough demand for anything, we'll make it, right? Yeah. Anybody will. And one thing I see on the side, there's a sticker. It says made in the USA. That's right. Is it actually made in the United it States is. with US stuff? Yeah. So uh, last year uh, in 2021, we ended up buying a sewing factory. And, you know, it's... Uh, 10, 15 minutes from our original shop. So we have two shops. One of them does a lot of sewing and a little machining. And then we do all of the machining, most of the machining in our Boise facility. So yeah, all made in Idaho, which means made in America by Americans. Awesome. Glad to hear that. So definitely a lot of really, really cool products. And this is just in addition to all the other really, really cool stuff that you guys have. Uh, where can people find more information about your products and I guess how can they purchase them? So we have a really great uh, online presence, odinworks.com. And then uh, we have a fantastic marketing team on Facebook and Instagram. And we're expanding into the others as well. But uh, probably Instagram and Facebook are the main uh, social media sites right now. Awesome. So those are the new accessories from Odenworks. Aaron, thank you very much for yeah, having you. me here once again and playing with us. Stupid excited about that bipod. Uh, I'm going to be really, really giddy waiting for it for the next couple of months. Uh, let me know what you think on that bipod and, and all the other goods that are here. Uh, if you have questions, leave me a question in the comments below. And as always, thank you for watching. Keep on squatting, and I'll see you in the next video linked up here. Awesome. Thank you.